The past seven months has been an absolute roller coaster for me. From full commitment to content, to working with a band, to doing IRL film for clients and companies, all the way to experiencing some eye-opening family trips, this gap year has been all over the place. It hasn't been what I've expected, to say the least. And that's what I'm talking about today, making the most of any given situation while not expecting perfection. In other words, life being really difficult sometimes. This past May, I graduated from high school. Although my senior year was one to remember, I was so ready to be done because I was taking a gap year off of school to pursue content. And that was my plan A, a whole 14 months of near uninterrupted focus to content creation. However, things didn't go according to plan. I was forced to take all of November off due to how much stuff I had going on. I had to focus on one of my relationships because of some interesting circumstances. I have gotten insane opportunities this year that I couldn't account for beforehand. I've been spending time bettering myself physically, mentally, and spiritually. I've been working with a former teacher and his band to set him up for success. I had no idea that I would be doing that. Life threw me cards that I didn't expect to have, but they were good cards and I'm glad I did all of these things despite the time it took. I have no idea if you're religious or not, but for me personally, I'm a Christian, so I believe that God is putting me through his plan A, but he is still recognizing my plan A. My plan A is not a plan B to him, rather two plan A's that are a bit different from each other. And I firmly believe that everyone can agree with this fact. Life is going to have its own flow and it's not gonna care about what your wants are. If that's the case, what do you do? Something I had to learn to do was to accept where I am and do the best I can to make the most of my situation. It's not every day that I'll get a cool opportunity, like doing a gig at a large SEC school with my band. The time it took was a lot, but it was worth it. You may have similar situations in your life where although it's not what you're wanting to focus on, it's still absolutely worth it. From my experience, making the most of that situation in the moment is the best decision. Sometimes it's not about what you want to do, Rather, it's just what you need to do. There have been some things this year that I needed to learn and God drug me through them so that I could figure it out. Life is gonna do that to you too. That being said, don't expect perfection in your plan of action. I think I was very naive when I was expecting this year to be solely content because chances are, you will never get 100% your way. However, you can usually do something to get some sort of percentage. Life has its own course of action and it doesn't care about what you want. So do your best to get something out of wherever life leads you to the original plan you had. Lastly, don't expect perfection in yourself. You need to understand that everyone is human and even you are going to make mistakes. Our efficiency, just like a machine because of friction, will never be 100% efficient. Above all else, make sure you give yourself the grace, forgiveness, and patience that your brain and body requires and deserves. If you enjoyed this video or it helped you out in any way, make sure to subscribe and like the video. I've got some other crazy stories and topics coming soon, but in the meantime, here's a video on my literal life-changing trip I took this past summer. Thanks for watching.